Hi and welcome to this Blueberry Markets video update with me John Kibler, Head Currency Analyst. In this video we're going to be going over Euro Pound as we have been triggered into a move short. So just wanted to explain and break down why we're looking for this opportunity in the first place. Well, uh, the pound is currently stronger than the Euro on the strength meter which is offering us some opportunities to look for some uh, shorts and the recent price action has been showing us that the market has been making these nice lower highs through here and recently we've broken out of this low area so we've made a new lower low on the daily time frame we're having lower highs coming down through pound is stronger than the euro We've seen this pullback yesterday and then a really nice, strong, bearish close. That suggested to us that we could see some further downside in the market. And the reason why as well is because there is a huge demand zone down here. So if we're looking at the market in the overall and we said, well, let's just say we wanted to be buyers of this market. Where would we want to be a buyer from? Now, I would want to be a buyer from where the institutions were doing their business. Now, they were doing their business down here. Um, the reason why we're doing their business down through this section here is because you can see that the strong buy momentum that came from this area when the prices got down towards this sort of uh, 0.85 area was quite strong we saw a significant reversal at that point so the theory is price may want to get back down into this zone before seeing another continuation so we have that other um, sort of demand zone as a confluence here for the potential for this market to continue to fall so we looked at the trade of a 50 percent retracement of yesterday's candlestick that has helped us to uh, get triggered on this move into the market but keep an eye on euro pound because we could see some further downside on some other time frames as well if we look to just take a look at this four hour time frame and if you've missed this sort of move in here we can see that we had a change in trend price came up retested that area we're now getting another what looks to be a strong bearish four hour close so if price continues to press to the downside and takes out these lows through here we could look for another short-term trading opportunity down into that demand zone but keep an eye on euro pound we could still see this short-term opportunity down through here thanks for watching the video and i'll speak to you soon